Hello and welcome back. We are here in Sky in <laughs> Skywatch anymore. We are here in Shipwreck Shore and we are about to head on off and see if we can go ahead and find these uh, shells, these um, horn shell horns, and we need two of them. So hopefully we will be able to track them down here in today's video. Uh, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, appreciate it. Let's start out. We are reviewing um, geometry and angles sort of throughout the ages. I think we're in about like the fifth to sixth grade range right now. Um, so let's actually do this. It's a little bit po more powerful. And so here is volume. Now volume is going to be multiplying. Come on calculator, there we go. Volume is gonna be multiplying the height times the width times the, that's a square on the bottom. <coughs> so that's a, okay. So by the uh, the height, the, the length, the width, and the height. And so our answer here is 26,912. <coughs> Pardon me. And let's go ahead and take a bite out of you with chomp. All right, just a little bit more left. I think Misty should be able to hand this, handle this if it lands. All right, so here, <coughs> We're entering our value now. So that's six times eight is 48 times nine. That's 432 kilometers squared, or cubed. Okay, and let's go ahead and see if down portal hits. If it does land, then we are finished. Awesome. So let's go ahead and move on. Here we go. All right. And let's head on up here. Our first sand pile is going to be right over here. We do have a muck stir to battle before. So let's go ahead and swing on over. All right. Nice hits there. Way to go. Congratulations. And muck stir fumbled. All right, so we have 13 times 19 times 17 because we are multiplying all of the values together to get the internal dimensions. That's 41.99. Woohoo! Okay. And the thing with, with calculator math, uh, actually, you know what? Let's see if Starbit is strong enough to get you. Probably isn't. Yeah, it's not. Um, so the thing about um, uh, calculator math is really all you have to focus on is uh, do you are, do, are you doing things correctly? Are you following the correct order? And if you are following the correct order, following the equation, then you're going to get it right. So stopping and thinking before you start plugging stuff in is super important. But once you have, okay, I need to do this, so I'm going to do this, then it's very easy and you just plug in more stuff. And as you go through um, uh, mathematics, the numbers get a lot larger um, and you work with them differently but as long as you follow that procedural I do this and then I do this and then I do this then it uh, comes off pretty easy all right so remember I have to do 26 times 24 times 23 if I follow that procedure then all I have to do is enter this in Woohoo! All right, and let's go ahead and do flood is only okay. So let's go ahead and roll the, is this? That's just okay too. Yeah, let's do down portal. And I don't know if this is gonna finish off. Probably, oh, it did, awesome. Yay. All right, let's dig up that sand pile and see what is inside. I cannot wait. All right, let's go ahead and what do we got? No, just copper coins. Okay, let's head on over here. And, ooh, there's not an Aquister. I mean, is, is this, I think this is the place where the Aquister just kind of stands there. Maybe, maybe that's up. All right. Love those crazy eyes. That is awesome. That's a, he, he has a fun animation. Okay, so four times one is four. Four times two is eight. So, woohoo, eight yards cubed. And let's go ahead and send. This is going to be weak against him, but I think it's still going to be my strongest. Uh, and then let's chomp you, and we should be able to finish you up. Feeling like a salad today. Munch, munch. And let's see what Misty does. 
So we have, uh, okay, this is calculator math here. Beautiful, beautiful calculator math. Three, 35 times 46 times 36. That's going to be 57,960. 57,960. Double check I did that right. Cool. And then also another thing with calculator math, one of the things you do have to double check is did you enter the numbers correctly for your answer? So you have to double check that step as well. Woohoo! All right, let's see what's in here. Wonderful. Um, if you are still watching, please go ahead and take a couple of seconds and make sure that you have subscribed. I appreciate it. You will see fun content like this. We'll go over math skills and we'll uh, play the game and uh, just reinforce all of the great learning that you are doing at school. Also, books and other things come out. I appreciate it. Also, comments are extremely helpful. They help the, chan the channel to grow and our community to grow even uh, larger and uh, develop more. So, appreciate all all of that and thank you of course for the likes as well all right let's get into a naughty battle okay and a funky old battle Benil battle my goodness all right that's a cool I like the mouth that's a cool animation let's go ahead and green gust them nice I don't think I have any lightning spells here all right, so break out the calculator, dust it off a little bit. 88 times 39 times 30. That's going to be 102,960. All right, and let's go ahead and do chomp here. Nice damage there. And, you know, let's try to do this. It's only good, but let's see. Not, not bad, not bad. Got the spin there. All right. And if you were moved right one and up one, we would be at 2-2. Two -two. Doing a little bit of ballet there, getting the 2-2 two -two on. Okay, let's do a star bit and finish up Benil. Goodbye, goodbye. All right, and here we are with down portal. 307, nice damage there. And I don't think Misty has enough to take them out, but so we're moving right five. So two, that would be six, five, seven, down three. So seven, one is where we would land. Woohoo! And let's go and see if this stream can go ahead and finish us up. I didn't think it was going to, so that's okay. And goodbye, Misty. Pretty soon you won't be leaving every single battle. But it will not be this day. All right, 183 points of damage there. Let's open this up. Look at all of these beautiful rewards. All right, continue onwards. Let's head on down. And let's go ahead and, yeah, let's get a little bit further on. And then we'll go ahead and wrap the video up. All right, so check out this Crookshank. He is throwing, Crookfang, he is throwing some stuff at us. I really don't know where my mind is. It's too early for me today. Um, if you moved right, seven. So three plus seven is going to be ten. And then down five, seven minus five is two. We would be at 10, two. Woohoo! All right, and let's go ahead and green gust you. Boom. All right, we should be able to finish you up this round. We'll chomp you in just a second. What is the area of this rectangle? So five times four, that is going to be 20. Woohoo! And let's take a bite out of you, buddy. And there we go. Awesome. So we are done here. Let's move up just a little bit further. Hey, Jelly Jim, how are you? Good to see you, buddy. All right, let's check this pile. Drum roll, please. 
And oh yes, we have a shell horn. That is awesome. So let's go ahead and take a look. I think we only need one more. We only need one more shell horn. So that is super exciting. Um, let's go ahead. I don't think there is anything in there. There is not. There is an angry looking crook thing. All right, hey Squibble. Let's come on up over here. And then up over here. Come on this way. All right. We're gonna check this last one, which means one more battle. Um, and then we'll go ahead and if, hopefully it's in here. If not, then we'll go ahead and end the battle. Either way, um, after we check that sand pile, we will be wrapping it up. I have a feeling like it's gonna be in there. All right, a couple of really nice hits there. Good job. Let's go ahead and send Green Gust your guys away. There we go, nice hit. Okay, and let's go ahead and take a chomp out of you and see if we can finish you up. Nope, not quite. All right, is it gonna be Misty to the rescue? Okay, so what is the area of this parallelogram? So the parallelogram, you would do the base, which is gonna be eight units times the height of it. So it's gonna be eight times nine would be 72. Woohoo, 72 units squared. And let's go ahead and do down portal. Hopefully we land on, no, we do not. All right, 181 there, that's good. Quick flip. Misses. And that's a fumble. Okay, let's go ahead and so four times 12 is 48 unit squared. Woohoo! And let's see, magic is refilled. There we go. Let's just see if we can do this all out and hit both of them. That was enough for you, and we missed, but that's okay. We got rid of one. And then that will make Ori easier for Ori. What 3D shape is shown by this net? So net is like a 2D thing you can fold up into a 3D shape. This would be a triangular prism. Oh, triangular based prism, a uh, pyramid, sorry, pyramid. Prisms have uh, long edges. So pyramid is what this is. Woohoo! Nets are really fun, I like them. All right, here we go with down portal. Hopefully that lands 331. Awesome. Goodbye, flick flit. Woohoo. And here we go. Okay, drum roll, please. No whammies. Are you there? No, you're not. Oh no. That feeling I had was wrong. It was wrong. Okay, that's okay. We are going to continue on next video. Thank you for liking. Thank you for subscribing. I appreciate all of the comments, and we will see you back here next time. Keep on prodiging on. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.